Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. It is so much fun. Excellent, a volunteer. No volunteers? <laughs> okay, I'll demonstrate. We're gonna take the war straight to Maria Marquesa. I've been waiting to do this a long time. First, her Ministry of Culture blacklisted us. Then they kidnapped me, tried to brainwash me, silence me. Well, we're going to censor la fucking censura, Danny. Her propaganda, billboards, advertising, her whole rum factory. We're going to fuck it up, bankrupt her. By the time we're through, Marquesa won't even have any ass left money left. Her fucking propaganda machine took our voice, so we got only one option left. Our bullets. Make that bitch pay. Danny! Danny! My best friend, my sweet little piglet. What? You, me, Segunda, Main Square, drinks, now! Sounds like you got a head start. <laughs> Coño. I'll be there when I can. Go easy, bicho. Oye, sending a pick of Marquesa's propaganda trucks. Sorry you have to look at her face. <laughs> Just another reason to take them out. Been sick of hearing her propaganda bullshit since Castillo took over. Fuck them up, Danny. Sneaky. Maria's room factory. Time to make some noise. Starting to feel like an ex. Maria's going to get the message now. Talia, I wish you could see Marquesa's face on fire. Jealous. What about her room factory? You hit that yet? Going to take it out now. Smash it up, Danny. That was for you, Talia. Dalia, Maria's room is out of business. Así mismo. She's going to be shitting her diamond encrusted panties. There is an image. Let's think bigger, no? Los muy come mierdas are putting up another fucking Anton statue at Presidente Square. I swear, it's the only way that guy can get hurt. <laughs> he's as good as gone, Dalia. Dalia, I'm at this statue. Bullets aren't going to cut it. I'm gonna need to blow it up somehow. Guess you gotta get creative, Gideon. See. Si.
Tokyo Cardio. Talia, it's done. Good. It's going to cost that bitch millions to get all that back. I thought you'd be more happy. Look, millions can't bring back what I lost. But that's okay because we're just getting fucking started. Hey, hey, it's Danny. Danny friend. Maximus Matanzas is fucking dead. Radio Libertad is dead. We were the mouth of the revolution. Mouth. Mouth. And you know what's even worse? This bottle is empty. How fucked up is that? You and me got a date with some cervezas. And then those cervezas friends and family, and cousins, every fucking cerveza on this whole stupid island. I have a plan. There's some soldiers here, and they have booze. But they, they, they don't need it like, like, uh, like we do. <laughs> Liberate the cervezas, daddy. <laughs> Fucking get your liver ready. We're gonna put that little guy through the ringer. <laughs> Bicho, our future is now. You are a genius. Let's do this! Priorities way! I'm feeling it. Definitely feeling it. Danny, you hear that? Music! Go, Danny! Oh yeah! Party time! 
Come on, you little fucker. Let's dance. That's a good boy. Leave your dog dance away. The fuck? Fuck you! Everybody dances. If Bicho is gonna dance, he's gonna dance to his own fucking music. Hey, got a request? See, si. can you play this? It will really cheer up my friend. Dale! You can't walk ten feet without placing a bet. Keep your money. Yes! This is my shit! <laughs> I'm fucking dancing! <laughs> Danny! Come drink with me! That's better. Bicho, where are you, you little pineapple hair fuck? Don't leave me alone out here! Oh shit! Phone! Danny? Hey! Where are you, man? Uh, Danny! Bicho, come mierda! Where'd you go? Danny, there's a really big dog here. Is that a cow? Where did you find a cow? Uh, he's really nice. He gives lots of kisses. Stay where you are. I'll come find you. <laughs> stop, stop it, bad dog. Get gone, you asesso. Hey, how do you become a guerrilla? Huh? Yeah. Like, uh, for Libertad? Does Clara give you a test? Yeah, Bicho. She makes you get up at like four in the morning and do push ups. What? Yeah, a thousand. If you stop, her buddy Juan shaves your ass and spanks you. And if you puke, they make you do math. Mayeva la chingada. Fuck your math? No way. No way, way. You're full of shit. You're lying. <laughs> Since when did you want to be a guerrilla? Never mind. Forget it. Danny! <laughs> Kate? I, I can't look at our old graffiti. It makes my heart feel like a bag of dog shit. We need to cover it up. Go, Danny. Paint my pain. Because that's what my dream is now. Radio Libertad is just a broken heart full of shit. There. Tag that shit. <laughs> now it's messed up. Fuck you, Castillo. Just like me. Okay. That's every single one. Really? How how many did you do? Like at least a hundred. Nice. Drink. Danny, I need to hear their voices. I need Maximus Matanzas right now. I need everyone in this whole town to hear them. The bicho, my little chalupa. <laughs> I think it's time for some real guerrilla shit. Follow me. Broadcast that shit, bicho. Let's make Saguna fucking dance. <laughs> for libertad. Coño, si. I'm going to remodel Maria's office. <laughs> Hang on. 
there's a password. Ay, pinga. Um, one, two, three, four. Wait, that's her? Detected character. The lack of decency of common morality. Take it easy. Oh, we must burn these. We are alive! <laughs> Danny, could you keep it the fuck down? I am trying to concentrate! I think I'm done with this town. Then, let's get out of here. It's not fair, man. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. <laughs> it is. What is it? You. I mean you. Look at you. Look at you. You want to do something, you go out there and do it. People see me, they think, fuck up. They see you, and it's, wow, the god of Yara. That is not what people see. Uh, bullshit, it is. No. Mm. They see this, and that's it. But I'm okay with that. Yeah, because you're a badass. You know, before Libertad, I had two best friends, just like you. Lito used to joke we were nothing but numbers to the rest of Yara. I was lucky orphan 13 at Esperanza School for the Lost. Then, got that 2683. And after that, Drafty 0418 to rebuild Castillo's paradise. When Lita died, she called me the lucky one. Like an idiot, I thought. Still just a number, Danny. A nobody. But I wasn't listening. She knew I still had a chance to be who I wanted to be. She was telling me not to waste it to act. People see what they want to see. Not a number, not a fucking gun. I'm a guerrilla. It's like you. I use this. And you, you use that. Huh? <sighs> hmm. But I could be a cool fucking gun too. Up. Let's see. Palo's gone. Bicho's a crying mess. And Talia's just fucking chaos. I think it's time to face reality, Danny. Maximus Matanzas is too far gone. I'm going to head back to camp. Talk to Talia. Don't give up on them yet, Clara. You're called, Danny. It's time to go face to face. We hit Maria's rum factory, we fucked up her billboards, and the bitch didn't even bat a fake eyelash. Meanwhile, Maximus Matanzas is dead, and I'm still stuck in this swamp. We've spilled real blood, Danny, and Marquesa doesn't even have a scratch on her. Fuck this. I'm gonna call out her bullshit right to her face. Marquesa's putting on a PR event, some kind of tour for foreign journalists. If you can get us passes, I'll give her a one-on-one -on -one performance in front of the whole world. Force them to hear the truth. Oye, 
Let's fuck up Marquesa's shop. Sounds like I missed the man. Press passes. Let's do this shit. Hola, reporter Benavides. Press passes? This is my shot, Danny. Got a shit hot song for that bitch, so don't fuck this up. Easy, Talia. Keep it together, okay? You keep it together, Danny. Don't lose those passes. Meet me and Bicho in the Botanical Gardens parking lot, and don't go in without us. Here, you're a reporter now. Felicidade. Fuck yeah. This is Talia Benavides from... Urban Garden? Coño, it's good enough. Take our stuff so we don't get shot. Let's change these clothes. Wait, aren't you... Silvio Balboa Garden City? Urban Garden? Can we move this along? Maria's waiting. Welcome, welcome, my beautiful foreign friend. for traveling so far to learn about Viviro, the Castillo administration's pride and joy. Let us begin. The architecture. Impressive. Nice. A lot of money not going to the rest of Yara. Today, I am honored and excited to share with you the miracle of Viviro, a revolutionary cancer treatment. Thirteen years ago, the brilliant biochemist, Dr. Edgar Reyes, discovered a compound unique to Yara that slows cancer cell growth. But it is Presidente Anton Castillo's full support that allows us to produce this all-natural drug. Come, witness a breakthrough of innovation, generosity, and true Yaren spirit. Follow me. Spasibo for the inside tour. You really make a reporter feel... special. Anything for you, Nikolai. <laughs> it all starts with Nicotiana Yarana, our native tobacco plant grown in our western farmlands. Our tobacco is world famous for its unique flavor. Wondering what made it so unique, Dr. Reyes studied the plant's properties. And I don't mean he smoked a lot of cigars. <laughs> he found a compound that actually slows cancer cell division, practically to a halt. This way, my lovely people. Ready for the next part of our Viviro adventure? <sighs> this interactive display will be available after the presentation. Dr. Reyes found that natural tobacco crops produced a limited amount of the compound. So, President Anton commissioned Yara's best minds to work with Dr. Reyes to design an all-natural fertilizer, PG-240. Spread on, like a hairspray, it uses gene therapy and nutrients to boost production of the compound. If you look, this tobacco has large red leaves. This is from the fertilizer. Beautiful, no? Puro, organico, e exotico. No? Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. It is so much fun. <laughs> Excellent, a volunteer. No volunteers? Okay, I'll demonstrate. Yeah, that's enough. 
Using McKay to sidestep embargoes was considered quite controversial. Those critics only want to profit from cancer, from death. They see us as a threat, so they try to ruin us. This way, por favor. Okay, closer, closer. Get intimate. <laughs> I want you to hear me. <clears throat> In Central Yara, our finest scientists extract, refine, and package the cancer fighting tobacco compound called Yarantin. Found only in Yaran tobacco. Dr. Reyes thinks Yarantin is why our cigars are so smooth. <laughs> Delicious and beneficial, no? I smoke one cigar a week and it keeps me skinny and strong. It's true. <laughs> okay, that's the tour. Our interactive stations are now available for you to enjoy. When you are ready, join me by the gate in the outdoor lounge for a surprise guest. There are rumors that farmers exposed to PG-240 are actually developing cancer from it. Rumors spread by fools and believed by idiots. It's not true. Uh-huh. Right. By slaves. and keep Castillo in power. And this ends our tour. But before we go, a surprise. Meet Dr. Edgar Reyes, the pioneer behind Viviro. Dr. Reyes, thank you so much for making an appearance. Ah, muy bien. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the showroom and some of our finest Yaren Rome. This is a preview of other Viviro products we are developing. Chewables, nasal sprays, vaginal suppositories. It is a, uh, I say, a sneak peek. <laughs> so peek, peek away. <laughs> if you have questions, please email my assistant, Julio.
Come now, Dr. Reyes. We don't want to be late. Neither do we. Let's get in there. I told Bicho to leave our weapons back here. I hope you're ready to fuck shit up. So what now? Take it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes. Good. No one knows we are here. Special program for you today. Maria Puta Marquesa, Minister of Culture, Uncle Anton's personal whore. You're also director to the True Yarn Academy, no? Where you fry people's brains to make sure they play nice? Like you did to me, right, Maria? What? Mm, don't play dumb, bitch! Daria, put the gun down. She's not worth it. You... You attacked my home. You put your filth on my network. You have any idea the embarrassment I had to endure because of your disgusting performance? I have given everything I am to be here. You think you can take that away from me? My academy was built to save fake yarns like you and that mari macho you spread your perversions with. Where is she? Does she not approve of you playing with guns? Fuck. Oh. Oi, let's go, let's go! What happened? Get her the fuck out of here! Fuck. Hello?
de que los hombres se rindan a su antojo. Madre este. Miles de dólares de allí en cada encuentro. Si la mueve, si la mueve, mira. Tania, Tania ran off and I don't know what she's going to do and I think I'm having a heart attack. Bicho, you're not having a heart attack. How do you know? We need Palo. Palo knows how to fix this. Palo's in Miami by now. No, 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 he's still here. Danny, go find me in the little mountain just west of the airport. There's a bunker, and I'll be the Mexican on top of it. Okay, okay, just take a breath. I'm on my way. Danny, we've got to fix this. I thought Radio Libertad would fix everything, but everything's fucked. Talia's doing some crazy shit. I haven't slept in days. I nothing's been right since Paolo left. My dealer swears he saw Paolo at the airport and he was with that fucker Bembe. Danny, you can't let Paolo leave. He's the only thing that could put Talia back from the cliff, Cardinal. I even tried to get Paolo, got as far as the airport gate, and then boom, soldiers everywhere. I squirted a little and I ran. You know I'm no good with soldiers, Danny. You got to get Paolo back. You got to make everything okay again. Paolo, what did you get yourself into? Where are you, Paolo? This place is crawling with soldados. They must have been waiting for Paolo. I like I'd like to think you're here to see your dear friend Bembe. But we both know you're after Paolo. Where is he? He's supposed to be on a first class flight to Miami right now. But you sold him out. No no no. This was one of life's rare surprises. Soldados were waiting for me, Rojas. So I struck a deal. So that's when you sold him out. I traded for my freedom and kickbacks. But I'm not heartless. I will tell you where they took him. Paolo's in a resort in Barrial. If they've done anything to him, I'm coming for you. Promises, promises. If I were you, I'd hurry, Rojas. Paolo's not in the safest of hands. Hey, bicho! Shut up for a second. He's been captured. They took him to a fucking resort. A, a resort? W what does that mean? Is Paolo okay? Is it a nice resort? Bicho! I'll call you when I have him, okay? Paolo better be here, or Bembe's a dead man. Paolo, it's Danny. Paolo. Pa 
Paolo! Paolo! new phones. They're so thin. <laughs> My pain is a part of progress. Yeah, I learned that from Castillo. Look at Bibero. He would have gone nowhere if I hadn't created the outcast camps. You know, orphans like you make the best death subjects, along with the poor. Anyone on the fringe of society. That's 0.5 cc's of PG-240, what you call the poison. It's being pumped into your bloodstream. Doctor's orders. All I have to do is call. Wakey, wakey, Danny. Miss me, motherfuckers? Come on, Cody, you're safe. You're with me now. He uh, put something in me! Oh, God! He put something in me! Get out to Matias! Fucking go! Oh, okay, okay. We meet there. Matias! Need your help! Danny, I can't talk right now. I got Paolo on the way with Talia. He was fucking El Doctor! He poisoned me! Need to get it out! Okay, you need to get to my clinic on your own. Take the road north. It's a straight shot to me. Got it, Danny? Danny? Take a moment and for science. Tell me how you feel. You're not real. By now, the PG-240 has worked its way past the blood-brain barrier. Shut up! Your neurons are firing randomly as they shut down. Your subconscious is taking over. Shut the fuck up! I have one request. Please leave your body in one piece for the autopsy. Real. Don't you get it? I never should have been on that boat, Danny. You put me there. We had to leave. Castillo was rounding up everyone. No, Danny. They were coming for you. I should have been with Clara, but I came to the city to say goodbye to you. Uh, how was I supposed to know? You took my place in Libertad. You just left my body rotting on the beach. It should have been you. Uh, I'm sorry! You had to be the lucky one. How does it feel? Has such a better ring to it. Alejo? 
You know what we're fun of system? He screams pity fuck. I was suppo supposed to die. It all happened so fast. I wasn't supposed to die. Is that all you have to say to me, Dan? You let my fucking corpse on that rooftop. They were going to kill us too. After the bullet went into my brain, I could still see. I lived just long enough to watch you and Lita leave me behind. Alejo, please stop. I shouldn't have left her. It was fucking Bembe. He sold us out. <laughs> Not like this. Not like this. We were supposed to come together, remember? Danny, what are you doing? Danny! Listen to me, Danny. Drop the knife. Big <laughs> deal, Danny. Welcome back, idiot. How's Talia? You're both lucky you have the best doctor in Yara. Where's Paolo? Just outside. Said he had a war to plan. Fuck. Now cut yourself open again, and I am not putting you back together. <laughs> 